Uh, Madam Mayor, we received questions from Mr. Styles and Ms. Wells in respect of similar uh, matters, so I might join them together for you. First question from Mr. Styles. I've been a sex worker for five years and regularly travel to Brimbank City Council to see my regular clients. How many sex workers who live or work in Brimbank did council speak to or consult with before finalising a submission to the state review to decriminalise sex work in Victoria? Second question also from Mr. Styles is, council's submission to the state review to decriminalise sex work in Victoria education refers to education and access to support networks for sex workers. Will council consider making a modest donation to a registered not-for-profit sex worker support group that operates in the city of Brimbank? And the next question from Ms. Wells, regarding the council's proposed submission on the Victorian review to decriminalise sex work, were any sex workers or sex worker industry slash advocacy groups consulted in preparing this submission? Thank you. Um, once Council became aware that a review was being undertaken, the relatively short time frame in which to provide a submission meant there was insufficient time for Council to consult with any sex workers, industry or advocacy groups on this matter. The submission is based on Brimbank's recent experience in dealing with alleged illegal brothels and feedback received from our community through this experience. In relation to question two, Council's community grant program is available for eligible organisations to apply and provides financial support to not-for-profit organisations and community groups. We will provide details of how you can apply. In respect of the consultation question, once Council became aware that a review was being undertaken, the relatively short time frame in which to provide a submission meant there was insufficient time for Council to consult with any sex worker industry or advocacy groups on this matter. The submission is based on Brimbank's recent experience in dealing with alleged illegal brothels and feedback received uh, from our community through this experience. I, note, I just want to note that this topic is also the subject um, to an officer report to Council um, later on this evening. Thank 